The University of Maryland football team is in the dog days of camp right now, preparing to kick off their season on September 3rd. Coach Mike Loxley wants to see them improve from last season, and he says they have the pieces to find success. There's been a ton of receivers that have really thrived in this type of offense, and we've been able to recruit some really good players. And having a Dante Demas healthy uh, ahead of schedule, having a Rockham Jarrett uh, with an experienced Rockham Jarrett now, uh, Jay Sean Jones back healthy, the addition of Jacob Copeland, Ty Felton coming along. Uh, we've surrounded Leah with some guys that can run, that have the ability to make plays, and and now what he's got to do is just find a way to. You know, be diverse with the ball, get it to these playmakers in space and let them make plays. Talking to Lox and he expects a lot of great things from you. What do you expect from yourself this season? Uh, just more production than last year. Uh, trying to be more of a leader, more vocal. Uh, I'm an older guy now, so a lot of guys are looking up to me. So just trying to be that guy that everyone's following. How is the knee feeling? Knee's feeling great. I'm glad to be back 100% with the guys, full go. So I can't really complain. The trainers got me to this point and I'm back. And Locke says you're ahead of schedule. He's hoping to see you in week one. When you hear that, how does that make you feel? Uh, that's been the preparation, just to be ready for week one. You know, the trainer's been on, been on me a lot, just to you know, stay, tell me stay calm and everything will come in. But I've been working and now I'm here, so I can't wait to, for week one. <laughs> you're getting Dante back as well. What have you seen from him in camp? Which, I mean, you see what you've seen all last year when he was out there. I mean, he's a playmaker. He's, he's a guy to be watched, and he, he's one of our offers in the room. The Turks will be practicing here for two and a half more weeks, and then it's time to head outside to the Shell, where they will kick off at noon, September 3rd, to Buffalo. I'm Charlotte McBride reporting from College Park, Maryland, WUSA 9 Sports.